Thanks everyone. It's been such a fun day at Push Your Wellness and we are so excited for our happy hour. Yes. I feel like this is like a happy ending. No, to I'm so excited. I set up a little garnish day. bar for us over by the a couch. A garnish bar? Yeah. Okay, well I have something set up for us too. Should we pour a drink first? And head over? Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> you like my little garnish set up? Yes, fancy. We did a little garnish spread. We spaced them out so that we, you could see which ones were probably better preferred with each. So with the Añejo, we have the vanilla bean like sticks, I guess. I don't know what the, you call those. I love those. And then sticks. cherry and orange. And then with the Repo, it's pineapple and coconut. And then there's these mango wedge things with tahini. For the Blanco, we have lemon and basil, the grapefruit peel, and rosemary. You know, a cocktail has a lot of sugar, so I'd say this is like a less sugar version of a cocktail. Push your wellness, babe. Push <laughs> your wellness. So the surprise is that we're gonna play truth or dare. Oh no. So here are the rules. When it's your turn, choose truth or dare. Okay. The other participant will pick a card from the corresponding stack and read it aloud. Black is dare, white is truth. Each participant can choose to skip three times, but then they must take a sip of tequila. Winner is whomever has the most points when the stacks of cards are finished or whomever passes out first. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Jesus Christ. So what do you want first? Truth. Okay. It's scary either way. Okay, weirdest food combo you like to eat. Oh, that's not bad. Toast with peanut butter on top and then eggs, like scrambled eggs. Oh my gosh. It's kind of random. That's a good one. I honestly haven't eaten it in years, but I used to eat it a lot. Mine is I eat like pickles with tangerines combined into a bite. I think I'll do a dare. Jump rope for 90 seconds, take a sip of tequila every time you stop. Okay, tell me when. Ready? Yep. I did two workouts today already. Pilates and Dawn. Oh wow. Well here's your third one. How long do you usually go for? I've done 20 minutes straight, no mess ups. That's not true, I don't believe that. <laughs> quite, the, quite the challenge. <laughs> it is, I'm totally out of breath. Time. Jump rope queen. Hell yeah. Okay. okay. I'll do a Kendall. Um, I'll do a dare. Okay. Oh, I hope it's not. Call mom and tell her you're pregnant. <laughs> Can I text her? No. I'm bad on It the says phone. call. I'd like to see your skills. Hello. Hi, mom. Hi, honey. So I have a scenario. Okay. I have not gotten my period in a little while, and I was supposed to get it like last week, so I kind of got nervous and like randomly took a test. Yeah. And it came back positive. So I took another one, and that one also came back positive. And I'm literally like about to cry. That's so weird you just told me this because I dreamed about this last night. Really? Really, really, really crazy. I'm kind of freaking out. I just like don't know what to do. Um, well, I'll put on my clothes and get over there. Um, well, I'll tell you, Kendall. Um, what? You know, you have to do whatever your heart tells you to do. I think it's great news, but I'm your mom, you know? Yeah. So. Uh, <laughs> mom, I'm just kidding. Mom, I'm, right mom. <laughs> <laughs> mom, I'm with Courtney. <laughs> She's just kidding, mom. Relax. Oh, fuck. <laughs> You're on, we're, we're playing truth or dare for Poosh. <laughs> Pulsed my card and it said to call you and tell you I was pregnant. All right, well, I love you and I loved your reaction. Oh, brother. Um, All right. Okay, bye. I'll go put the champagne back on ice. Okay, bye. Okay, I'll do truth. Biggest lie you ever told? Probably like to my parents. Right. Like I said, I stole the car when I was 15 and didn't have a license with like this guy, Jason Miniam, who was Kim's first boyfriend. The housekeeper like told on me and then I got in trouble and like I lied and said that it wasn't true and like whatever. I was grounded for like a whole semester. I would tell mom and dad every night, I'm going to Lara's Lonnie's house. Like I'm not, I'm going to Lara's house, I'm going to Lara's house. But would they not call the parents? No, I could drive at this point. My so dad I was would call parents. 
They mm -hmm. wouldn't, but they, mom even told me, she's like, I knew you were going to your boyfriend's house. Truth or dare? Dare. Text our family group chat that you just got engaged. Oh my God, <laughs> mom's gonna be like, what is <laughs> happening? But it's believable, so I will do it. Okay. Does anyone have a Does wedding ring? That's weird. I don't want to take your wedding ring and put it on my wedding ring. My what finger. if you take it? Yeah. Is that weird? I feel bad. I swear I feel bad. You don't have to give it to me. I don't know. I just feel like it's weird that I'm putting your wedding ring on. <laughs> oh, oh my God. God. This is amazing. I just can't wait to see. You know, Chloe's going to write a novel. Okay. Do I just say, guys? Hi. No. I know your life. We're playing truth or dare, and that was her dare. Good text, everybody. Yeah, but play into it. Play into it. it first of all, it doesn't fit you. I <laughs> well, it needs to be sized. Hold on, I'm answering Kim. Wait, no, no. <laughs> you're lying, because you're, you're at home. <laughs> We're playing truth oh or dare God. for Poosh. I'll let you respond however you want in the chat. Just okay. keep it going. I was like, what? <laughs> Bye. Kendall, wait, what? Kendall. We're playing, We're playing truth, truth or, dare. or dare. And that was my dare, was to text oh the family. That's, that's so stupid. Why would you do that to I know, it was so fun. Well, at least we know you guys will be excited when the day comes. I know, you guys were so hyped. <laughs> I was just disappointed it was a little big on your finger. I was like, you couldn't have gotten the size right? <laughs> no. Um, What's happening? Nothing. We're just it's playing Peter. Don't worry. She's playing a freaky game. We already told mom she was pregnant five minutes ago. <laughs> okay, we gotta go. All right, bye. All right, love you guys. Love bye. you. Okay, I'll do truth again. Where's the craziest place you've made out with someone? Maybe in a car while the person was driving. That sounds very unsafe. It is, I don't recommend it. I'll do truth again. Okay. If you could have one superpower, what would it be and why? It's really between being invisible, flying, and reading minds. Oh, okay, so I don't think I would want to read minds. It's just a lot of information. Yeah. It is. And then I think... So we could take that one out. Being invisible. Being in, but then it's like, are you going to use it for the right reasons? It's, it's kind of the reading the it's minds. It's kind of like, yeah. Whole, you know what I mean? Yeah. I think... I think flying. Maybe flying. Just imagine you can get from... Or teleportation. Ooh, I know. That's what I was just going to say. Time traveling. Teleportation or time travel. That time would be amazing. Travel. But is that a superpower? Yeah, I think it could be. I think time travel to be able to go back to any era and yeah. like live in that moment in time. Because totally. being able to go places, like we can do that in a different way. Yeah. I think I'll do one more truth and then maybe we'll do a dare. If you had to be roommates with one of your sisters, who would it be? Well, that's I've, for you, right? Yeah, I've been roommates with Chloe and Kim. You've been one with me for like a short oh, and amount you. of time. I have. Not as long as I that, haven't but. been one with Kylie. I mean, you guys are all good roommates. I think Kim and I, with like our kids and the kids' ages and all that stuff, we're kind of on the same like schedule. So I think I would say Kim. <laughs> Take a shot of tequila while you're doing the splits. I can't do the splits. I wonder if I, I can. can stretch. You know, I did try to do the splits here at this very table before, and I think that's where I fucked myself. Well, that's pretty close. I'll take one with you. Who is your favorite sibling? I don't Besides have one. me. <laughs> no, I'm serious. I really don't have one. Like, that's the worst question. Like, I can't even. Yeah, I think there's different siblings for different moments. Moments of like, yeah. what, like, if you're in a, like, if I'm going on a kid's trip, then I, my favorite right. is Kim. Or even I think that, like, we as siblings have, like, moments in time like we'll i'll be closer with someone for a moment and then i'll mm -hmm. get closer with another for a moment you know what i mean like yeah. i think we go it's in like all different things are like we're into traveling to the same place right yeah i think it all like depends thank you to everyone for joining us to all of our sponsors and our push community for spending this beautiful day with us all of today's content will live on Pusha's YouTube channel. Anytime you're feeling 
If you want to watch me and Kendall play Truth or Dare, you can just go to our Poosh YouTube. Cheers, girl. Cheers. Poosh your wellness.